Hello guys, welcome to Mahatma Biology classes. In this video, we are going to discuss about spoilage of fish. In previous videos, we have discussed about spoilage of meat and vegetables and fruits. Okay, in this video, we are going to discuss about spoilage of fish. Here, let's start. Fish. We all know that fish plays a significant role in human nutrition throughout the world. That fish consumed throughout the world at higher consumption levels. Okay. And fish contains mycomata. Here mycomata means these are the short segments of muscles called myotomes. Fish contains 15 to 20 percent of protein and less than 1 percent carbohydrates and fats almost all zero. That means it is protein rich food. Okay. And next subject to contamination. Fish is subject to contamination of microorganisms in their natural environment only and as well as those acquired during catching and handling and processing. Fish subject to contamination that is contamination occur via catching and during the handling and during the processing and as well as in their natural environment as well and freshwater fish contains fish which lives in freshwater contains aeromonas lactobacillus alkaligens and streptococcus these are the microorganisms they contain these microorganisms in their bodies these are the microflora of that fish. Here microflora means microorganisms which are inhabiting in that living organism. Here that organism is fish. Right. And marine water fish contains. Marine water fish means fish which are live in marine water. Such as sea and oceans. Sarsina, Micrococcus, Bacillus, Pseudomonas, Fluorescence. These microorganisms present in marine water fish and spoilage of fish here spoilage may be fish may be spoiled by autolysis self breakdown like oxidation through oxidation process or microbial activity it is important because our topic is this spoilage by microorganisms are most combination of these microorganisms and oxidation autolysis. Okay, most fish flesh is more perishable than meat. That means it contaminates or it decays very quickly because of more rapid autolysis will occur in these organisms. Those are the fish. During spoilage, pseudomonas and acinobacter and flavobacterium are predominant in number. If we observe the flesh of fish, we can identify these microorganisms in the spoilage, in the spoiled fish, okay, which are these pseudomonas, acino, acinetobacter and flavobacterium. In marine fish, TMAO will be low by bacterial and enzymatic action to TMA a spoilage product. Here TMAO means trimethyl amine and oxide. Here in marine fish it is an organic compound. It is present in the marine fish um, by the spoilage by the means of bacterial and enzymatic action this TMAO that is the trimethylamine and oxide is converted into TMA that is it is reduced into oxide is reduced into TMA TMA which is a spoilage product okay and order that is the smell of TMA which is a spoilage product at low levels still fishy order will occur this smell will occur and discoloration of the fish flesh it is a spoilage of sign color will change and examples are micrococcus and bacillus species here some examples of spoilage of fish discoloration causing microorganism is pseudomonas and spoilage is putrefaction that is the degrading the decaying of the food deterioration of the food 
that is here fish causing microorganism is micrococcus it is about spoilage of fish let's recall it fish plays a significant role in human nutrition throughout the world and fish contains mycomata and fish is a protein rich food and it is almost uh, absent in fats and uh, it is subject to contamination uh, in natural environment as well as during catching handling and processing and fresh water fish contains these microorganisms those are the aeromonas lactobacillus alkaligens and streptococcus and marine water fish contains thalassemia micrococcus bacillus pseudomonas and fluorescence and spoilage through autolysis oxidation and microbial activity are the combination of these all and uh, the tmao reduces to tma which is a spoilage product and this will uh, this will cause order of stale fishy order and discoloration will occur um, and examples are here thank you for watching i hope you understand